Hey guys, this is Mr. Fender Rhodes. Thanks for tuning in today. Before I release a new weekly jam on Wednesday, I would like to show you my approach of getting the right accompaniment for a track you eventually sent me. Here I am with Rhythm Scola from who, for whom I pl I've played on several remixes already. I took the one fade for this video. Um, yeah, take you into into a short musical journey. Um, so here I have the uh, small excerpt. Yeah, first thing um, um, I would I would do is um, to get to know the chords. So at least there's no actually no other instrument than bass and rhythm so the bass plays something uh, two chords I can hear it's very deep it's hard to hear so the first one um, is more like um, B, B minor, and the second one is A. So I change uh, the field. So I basically have B minor and A major where I don't know actually, uh, not yet, I don't know yet whether the 7th is, so I, I leave that out for a moment. So we have B minor in general and the A major. So we see how it fits. I mean, it's a little bit loud. So this is the first thing, that the chords or the, the notes, um, what I should use. So the second thing is the, the rhythmic stuff. So this is this example is pretty uh, rhythmically and I have to make a decision. Either I put something um, similar or something even more rhythmic uh, to it or I do something more um, pad like or more um, I lay there only notes or something I mean it could be a, a third um, I mean there are endless possibilities but in general um, so I could also um, put single notes in there so single notes just laying laying chords or do something rhythmically rhythmically and actually I want to try everything every one of the three options for you so you can hear the difference and how it would how it would change the color of the track so the first one the first um, the first option um, just laying chords you already heard I, I make it a little longer
So, um, this could be an option. And the second thing is, if I if I go into the rhythmic stuff, I hear there's a lot going on. So we have this this bass. So either I can go with the rhythmic stuff, so it could be like this. So then it is more in, in place or like uh, every, every instrument plays the same. And eventually I would choose the more um, um, like that I add something to it, probably more than that. So, um, so I make a, um, make a loop. So to try some things, maybe four bars. I think I would keep the one. Right. can see um, so most of the time I learn something uh, near that so that my instrument gives some some rhythmic stuff to the to the music and um, yeah um, I really like it so the thing is I have to uh, be careful because um, this option um, puts a lot more um, more um, more um, there happens a lot more than in the music and I have to be sure the one who's producing the music if, if it's not me so I uh, somebody sent me this track so Chris um, rhythm scholar sent me this track and I have to be careful what he wants to achieve so important or most important thing is that I get a uh, briefing about what he expects so if he expects more to happen, so I probably would choose that. If he um, suggests um, that I like make it broader or wider, I probably would more choose to put um, more chords, only chords in it, colors. And what he actually uh, wanted me to do was <laughs> putting the single notes in it. So um, I will try this also. Not only single notes, but like phrases or licks. So I take another, um, I take another um, loop, let me see. Where the other instruments are also, also there. Guitar. Not this too much with the strings. Um. Okay, I double it.
And same thing, um, uh, I put there something in it that adds something to it. So I won't go with the bass, or I won't go with the guitar, um, or even with the singer if it's there. Yeah. Um, so this was um, like a short uh, leak, <laughs> short leak into um, how I would approach um, an accompaniment for a track you sent me. Um, yeah, thanks for being part of uh, of the uh, of the video, and please connect via Facebook or subscribe to my YouTube channel for um, a new weekly jam on um, on different tracks on every week and I'll have this other specials in future. Yeah, thanks for joining and <coughs> see you next time. This is Mr. Fan Rhodes. Bye.